We start in the city of Los Angeles tonight, where one of the nation's strictest vaccine mandates is set to go into effect next month. The sweeping measure would require proof of vaccine for anyone and everyone entering a bar, a nightclub, a nail salon, a gymnasium, or an event with more than 10,000 people present. Retail grocery stores and pharmacies are not included in the mandate. Some critics argue that a mandate of this scope would amount to the segregation of those who cannot or refuse to be vaccinated. Others call it unenforceable. Sandra Mitchell has more. At the V Tree in Silver Lake soon, it will be vegan soul food only if you're vaccinated. It's hard. I understand keeping everybody safe. The LA City Council today. Close the roll and tabulate the vote. Passed what is believed to be the strictest vaccine mandate in the nation. Businesses will be required to get customers to show proof of COVID vaccination. Do you think you'll have to turn customers away? I hope not, you know, especially during these times, you know, every cent counts. So turn away customers is not something that we're looking forward to. This new law will be enforced at indoor public places, malls, movie theaters, gyms, bars, restaurants, hair and nail salons for ages 12 and up and with some exemptions for medical and religious reasons. It starts November 4th. We're getting tired of protecting people who do not want to protect themselves. COVID-19 cases are declining here in L.A., but the virus is still a real threat. A lot of business owners say they want to do the right thing, but they're concerned about losing customers. And I feel like it's necessary, but um, it is definitely going to hinder some um, regular business procedures. And so I'm kind of happy, kind of worried. <laughs> And that was Sandra Mitchell reporting. Now, this comes as a separate vaccine mandate is set to go into effect tomorrow in Los Angeles County, requiring coronavirus shots for guests at theme parks such as Universal Studios and Six Flags Magic Mountain, as well as sporting events like Dodger games. This does not apply to Disneyland or Knott's Berry Farm as they are located in neighboring Orange County.